are coming in or young men that are coming into the business that they don't have to define themselves for at one thing. You can be a writer, producer, director, actor. You can do it all. And it's smart to do it all, to what, have all of that. Speaking of the all of it all, what's next for you? What do you want to do I'll, besides return to the singing of it all? <laughs> well, yeah, I'll do that. Uh -huh. um, I think... I want to, I, you know, I'm a writer and I have some scripts out there. I have some shows out there. I'm a, I want to direct. I want to do all of that. I want to be a part of, you know, I don't know. I want to be a part of all of that things in the industry. But one of the most important things I really want to do is just help, honestly. Like if this, I say this to God and he, and I'm going to say it on camera now, but um, I, I love acting and it's something I want to continue to do. And I love this business in mm -hmm. a way, but I can leave it any second and be okay. And that's new for me. That's like over just past six months that I could say that and be like, oh, you know, the career is this, but I really could leave it and just go help and be like in a third world country or in, you know, New Orleans, for all that matters, with Katrina victims that are still suffering and help and be at peace with that. Mm -hmm. You know, so I'm excited about this career and I love it, but it, it has, you have to have more than, than the career in order that to. That defines you. That defines you. Because Absolutely. if you walk in here, there's a lot of crazy people in this business because the business is their focus um, and it can drive you crazy if it is but you know it should just be something you enjoy that your life is separate from it you know what I mean absolutely and I'm gonna tell you this I'm gonna give you something for free mm -mm. Mm. I love free yeah I'm gonna give you this for <laughs> free and that is that you already know that fear and faith can't exist in the in same, same place you no. already know this you I know do. I this do you know, know. But also think about this when you when you start talking about helping people, mm -hmm. that that one gift that God has given you, that you're fearful to let out there, could be the very thing that He uses not just for you but as a tool somehow to bless the people. Mm. Do you follow what I'm saying? I so do. you you might and in your own way you might be keeping them from getting what they're supposed to get through you. Okay, can we can we just talk about how fabulous that just was? Oh, <laughs>